<laughs> we found a personal electric vehicle that's 100% fun and 0% practical. Don't hold it for too long. We traveled to Las Vegas, Nevada to hang out with Law and to learn more about his PEV collection. And from his circus of PEVs, we found a peculiar personal electric vehicle that caught our attention and stole the show. The cars are a little tight. <laughs> What's the weight on this? This is uh, 140 pounds. It's a little juicy. Yeah. <laughs> but if you're going that fast, you want a little more weight. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoa. What's up guys, Jimmy Chang here. I'm here with Law and I'm here with Brian. Hello, In today's hello. video, we're gonna be going over the weird, wonderful PEVs that are in the world. Tell us really quickly why you decided to get this. I saw this online that Alien Rides was doing their whole reviews with the K4. Uh, went over there and had a beautiful time. I remember as soon as I got to PEV Works, I was just beyond excited seeing this thing. I had a huge smile on my face. I could send you the video of that thing. And this thing's beautiful, man. I mean, the range, the power, nothing can touch it. We did some drag, rates, drag races in the tunnels out down here. And this thing, if, if I throw on the uh, new tires onto it, no, no one's gonna be able to beat it. Is this your doing? I, I threw it on just to make it a little bit more ergonomic. Wow. So you're in mode two because this thing is powerful enough as is. So it goes up to 60 miles an hour, over 100 miles range. Yeah. And uh, power like you won't believe. <laughs> so I'm just going to take it for a nice little stroll. Yeah, okay? we're putting you on medium mode to okay, it's on keep medium it a little mode. bit less sketchy. Whoa. Woo. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and this thing will put a smile on your face. It's smooth. I this thought it'd thing, be jerky. Is it? It's not. So it it's like here, a sine wave controller. If you put yourself on a uh, fun mode. Fun mode. There you go, you're on fun mode. That's okay. when it'll get a little jerky. <laughs> There's a light on the back. <laughs> Don't hold it for too long. That's a lot of torque, man. It's powerful. <laughs> I'm surprised. I yeah. am really surprised. You want to try it, Brian? Uh, you, yeah. Keep, you, keep some fingers on the, <laughs> on the uh, brakes. Keep some fingers on the brakes. There you go. Which is front, it doesn't last. Nice. Yeah. That's fun. The weight of it makes it feel pretty stable yeah, at higher yeah. speed. I yeah, could the, see going a long distance on this. Just only, cruise along. Yeah, the, the only thing is, like, without the pads, it hurts your back. And then yeah. on top of that, the um, because the weight's all the way to the back, uh, or at least your body weight's all the back, um, the turn, left. turning at higher speed, it makes it a little sketchy. You end up drifting out a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. I was just trying to get used to the feel yeah, of it. Yeah, no, for sure. Like, no effort. You're already. <laughs> So how, what are the size of the stop ones? <laughs> yeah, you can turn pretty sharp. I was a little hesitant yeah. about turning yeah, yeah, yeah. sharp on it. It's, yeah, once you get comfortable with it, then it's not hard to throw around. Well, yeah, these are the pedals that it ends up coming with. Okay. Yeah, it's just little tiny dinky ones. So those are the stops. So, yeah, we, we, we made it a little bit bigger. <laughs> yeah, but I guess you're just kind of resting your feet there. Exactly, you're not, yeah. You're not standing on it. Yeah, no, a not at all. Yeah, like especially with, the, with your weight all the, way, all the way in the back, you have not nearly as much potential so have, uses. Have you ridden, have you rode it with a smaller one? I have. And you can really lean into the turn then? You can. Yeah. Yeah, but it becomes a little bit more sketchy because yeah, the outside weight. of the pedal yeah. is your leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> also note this, the, uh, that's the uh, Gatway speaker from like the same as the RS. Oh yeah, that's yeah. right. It's got this brake light. Yeah, yeah it'll, it'll mm -hmm. light up or light up brighter when you're braking. And is then along with that, you can do uh, turn signals. Ah. Oh, wow. It doesn't come with any key. No. Um, so there, is there a code or anything? None. Nothing. I, I would just be concerned of like some yeah, kid it, like no jumping park, on it. Uh, yeah, there's no parking this anywhere and yeah. no, this is a has to be with you type of vehicle. All right, I got my safety gear on. I'm gonna take this Extreme Bull K5 for a little spin here. So every now and then a device comes along that surprises me. And this is one of those things. When I first saw it, I was like, no, this, this is a gimmick. This is weird. Um, and then most recently we reviewed the Fido Beast, the weirdest scooter in the world. That, that thing's just child's play compared to this. <laughs> this thing is legit. This is a, a legit speed <laughs> demon. Yeah, this thing is amazing how powerful it is. You, you're, I feel like I'm already going fast and then I just give a little bit more juice to the throttle and uh, boom, it just takes off. I feel like I need to lean into it. 
With front and rear 3,500 watt motors for 7,000 watts of extreme power paired with comfortable suspension and a very low center of gravity, the Extreme Bull K Series is instant adrenaline filled fun like nothing you've ever experienced. So we geared up and went out for a ride. Brian started off in the first of the three modes to give him a chance to get used to the unique riding position of the Extreme Bull before moving on to modes two and three, which Law calls fun modes. Think you can do a 100 mile ride on that thing? I don't know. <laughs> I think that's a little long. Suspension feels nice on this though. It didn't take Brian long to get comfortable on the Extreme Bull and to ask Law for an upgrade in power. Okay, uh, can I try up the next level? You want a fun mode? Yeah. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty good here. So All right, far. so it's triple tap? Oh yeah. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> You're in fun mode. Just please be careful. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Woo <-hoo. laughs> Is the suspension holding up? Yeah. <laughs> this extreme bull is what you get when you give engineers free reign to come up with something crazy. Filled with power and speed, this thing has little practical use other than high speed thrill rides and for showing off at group rides. The torque on this thing is unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> hey. That thing could handle the streets of Seattle, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, easy. <laughs> In this? Back wheel a little further, right. the rider a little more forward. Exactly. Yeah? yeah? Okay. Let's do it. The low to the ground position makes you feel like you're riding even faster than you actually are, which makes it a ton of fun, but it also makes you harder to see when in traffic. Assume that you're invisible to cars, and while the insane power is exhilarating, remember to ride responsibly. Well, you know, super steady. So that's one-handed steady, because you can't do that on a scooter. Yeah. It just does, maybe because you have a lower center of gravity. I think so. There he goes. We were having so much fun, but we were also running late and our wives were waiting, so we hurried back. Brian and I have known each other for a long time and we've learned that the things we find to be the most awesome, our wives often frown upon. How would our wives respond when they see Brian pulling up on the extreme bull? Actually, when she sees the <laughs> <Okay. ones. laughs> Which, which car? They're all beer. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a mini car. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> you guys put uh, some sunblock on? Nope, no, no sunblock. Nope. It's not tanning day. Get these guns a little darker. <laughs> Did you were like, are you riding a hoverboard? Or riding? <laughs> right. We didn't see the wheels. Yeah. Yeah. It reminds me of like Mario Kart, the yeah, little, little like, bike. Really. <laughs> yeah, it's very smooth. You want to try? No, no, you don't want to try. Oh, too much. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, too, yeah, too this, this one's uh... Oh. Is that crazy? Oh, look! It's yeah. a skid mark. It's a little quick. Yeah, it's yeah. a fun toy. <laughs> nice. I'm going to order one for you, hon. You know how fast I would go, go like yeah. by miles. I'm not relaxed. Yeah. This one is it. different than a scooter. Like a, a yeah. scooter, you yeah. feel unstable. This feels yeah. very stable. Special thanks to Law for letting us try his extreme bull. I'll have a link in the description where you can learn more about it. Thanks for watching, and when you ride, remember to wear your safety gear.